Hello citizens and welcome back. This is our match reaction to Chelsea 4, Man City 4 in the Premier League. Make sure to hit the like button, hit subscribe as well. And let's jump into it. So Chelsea 4, City 4. I mean, where do you even start with that game? You know, we took the lead, we went behind, we took the lead again, then we threw it away in injury time. You know, 4-4, looking at it, it's probably a fair result. It was a crazy game. You know, neither team deserve to lose really and I said in the match preview I expected this is kind of how it was going to go I didn't think it was going to be 4-4 but the way we play the way they play it was made up for a game like this Chelsea were always going to score goals in this they were always going to have chances and that's just what happened you know and you can't really argue with City's lineup it was pretty much as expected Doki went on the left instead of Grealish you know and everyone else yeah you know they kind of picked themselves you had um Roger in midfield with Alvarez and Bernardo folded on the right, Haaland in the middle. You know, Akanji, Diaz in the middle with Walk on the right and Guardiola on the left and Edison in goal. And that team, yeah, that, that team is a strong team. It's what, well, pretty much our best team. There's only a couple of players you may change in there. Maybe another one or two, depending on, you know, who you prefer really. But that team is capable of winning the league and it's capable of winning this game. That being said, like I said, we play such a high line and we play so aggressive and we saw Chelsea against Tottenham. They just took advantage of the way Tottenham play, which is how we play. And we got punished for it, you know. But what it did make for was an end-to-end -end game and it was a it was a fantastic game from end-to-end. -end. The penalty, people are going to say, was it a penalty on Haaland? You know, they were both pulling at each other. There may have been a couple of fouls leading up to it. I was surprised it was given. I am. That being said, Penn, Haaland tucks it away nicely. Then they go up the other end, they get a goal and, you know, City do their thing, which is when, when we can see the goal, when we go behind or team draws level against us, we push high, you know, we go even higher. And at points in that first half and definitely in the second half, there were points when our, our like last defender was over the halfway line. And on this Chelsea team, with all that pace they've got front and the way they get bodies forward, that is absolutely criminal. And we were made to pay for it again and again and again. And in that first half in particular, their midfield was faster, stronger, and they just looked like they had many more bodies than us. They had, you know, they were getting up and down the pitch better. They, were, they had so much speed and they, they were just overrunning us a lot in that first half. And we did well, in fairness, to get back to 2-2 at the end of that first half. It was a great header from Akanji, well-worked corner, Alvarez to Bernardo, good cross from him. And it was a well-worked goal in 2-2. Again, probably a fair reflection at the end of the first half. Second half, same thing happened. We take the lead and then we, uh, we give it away again um, twice. I think we gave away the lead twice, didn't we, in the second half? It was an absolute disaster. And really, you're thinking when we scored at the end of the second half with Rodri, with the deflected goal from um, Thiago, you expect us to... I wasn't really expecting us to shut it out, but I was expecting us to defend a little bit better. But we just didn't. And again, we got caught. They hit us. And somehow Brogier in the box is all that time and space. And then in the end, he's brought down for a pen. And that's what it is. You know, it finished 4-4 at the end. It was an end-to-end -end game. Probably the best game of the season. You, you can't really ask for a better game than that. But again, we've just punished so many times for the way we play. And we're not going to change the way we play. Of course not. And it's going to be teams. You know, it's going to be teams. I'm just watching. Um, just, just watching um, Pochettino going mental there. Uh, because the referee blew when Chelsea won the counter attack, which probably saved us there. Could have been five four at the end. Um, but look, it's a frustrating game in many ways. But you can't really argue against the scoreline. It does mean we're top of the table by a point. Um, but it could have been so much better, and probably should have been so much better. Better after Rodri scored, but you just never felt safe. There's not one point in this game where I thought we were comfortable because I always thought Chelsea. Probably edging the better team, probably. And I said in the match preview, if you don't look after that pace, you don't look after their counter, we're going to get hurt. And unfortunately for us, you know, you had Sterling score, Palmer scored at the end as well. You know, and these plays that were letting go, like Palmer, I said in the match preview, I hope we've got a, uh, a sell on fee clause for him because he's going to go for over 100 million when he next gets sold by Chelsea. And it's absolutely criminal that we let him go as cheap as we did and to a rival as well for as cheap as we did. That is that is what it is. 
So yeah, four four it finished. Great game. Good result, I suppose. If you asked me before the game, would I take a draw away at Stamford Bridge? I would. I'd take a draw. But with Liverpool our next game up, I would have liked all three points in this one. Here we go again. Good game. Um, thanks for watching. Thanks for checking out the match shots and keep an eye on the player ratings that'll be coming next. I don't even know what to give everyone. It's one of those. I mean, who'd you give man of the match in this? No, I have absolutely no idea. Um, so yeah, keep an eye out for that and hit the like button. Thank you very much. Bye bye.